Making your own homemade cultured butter or makkhan is easy, you just need a KitchenAid mixer for it and a few ingredients. The first one we've got here is one quart of heavy whipping cream. And the second one is one cup of dhani. If you don't have access to your own dhani, it's fine. You can substitute with one cup of Bulgarian buttermilk. After we put those in, we're gonna cover up our mixer so we don't get splashing and start it on the second speed. We're gonna let it mix for 11 minutes. We measured it and 11 minutes is what it took for it to start fluffing up a bit. Then we bumped the speed up to number four and we left it for 10 minutes on this. You can see now that it's turning into a nice, almost whipped cream consistency. And further in, it starts getting even thicker and that's when we go to a higher speed. We moved up to number six. We're gonna leave it there mixing on speed number six for seven to eight minutes. Long enough for it to thicken to where the mixture starts having some resistance. Then we turn it off to help the mixer out by scraping everything into the middle. After that, it goes back on at speed number six. We're just gonna let this keep mixing until we hear a very distinct watery sound. That's how we know we're done. This is it, that's the sound. So now it's time for us to turn it off before we wreak havoc on our kitchen. And there's the butter. At this point, we got some ice water to shock the butter just to make it a little easier to remove from the mixing head. We just pour the water over, scoop the butter out, and we're ready to eat our cultured butter. We made this batch of makhtan to eat with homemade sag and makki di roti. We've got videos for both of those on this channel as well. If you'd like to check those out, I'd really appreciate it. And appreciate you watching this one. Please let me know if you tried this recipe for yourself. And as always, thank you for watching.